Hi, this is Rachel Stone at Commonwealth Computer Training and I'm talking about using lookup fields in access tables. This is an access database that's open here and I have an orders table. This orders table will reference a product and a contact information that's found in other tables. My products are listed in this products table and my contact names are listed in this contact information table. Now in this orders table, I want to customize these fields so instead of having to type in the product name or type in the contact name, I can actually have a drop down list appear that pulls that information from the corresponding tables. I'll start by going into my order table design view. And for my product field, I'll select the data type drop down and choose lookup wizard. In this case, I want it to look up values from another table. I'll click Next. I'll select my Products table and Next. Now I want to show the uh, product name, so I'll double click Product Name so it shows in my selected fields. Click Next. And I would like it to, it, you can have it sort according to another value. I can have it sort numerically by code or so on, but I'll just leave that blank and click Next. It's showing me what it would look like. I can actually modify the column width here if, my, if some of the names happen to be longer than others. I'll just leave it at about this width. I'll click Next. It's asking to verify the name of this field, product, which matches product in my table. And I'll finish. It prompts me to save. Now I'll flip over to my table view and you'll see I'll go ahead and put an order date in. And for my product, there's my drop down list and you'll see it's pulling for me the product names from the other table. Now I'll repeat this, I'll repeat this process for the contact and I'll have it actually display two fields in my contact field. So I'll go back to my design view and for my contact field I'll go back to the type and select lookup wizard. Again this data is contained in another table so I'll choose next my contact information table selected and next. And this time I will double click last name and first name and I chose last name to be at the top so it would sort alphabetically by last name. And I'll choose it to be for the last name to be in ascending order. It's going to display for me what it looked like and again I can modify the widths of these columns. I'll choose next. It's still called contact, that's fine. And I'll finish. I'll save and I'll go back to my datasheet view and there's my contact names and you can see I have the first and last names here of my uh, contacts and I could select one and it just stores the last name here for me. And that's how to use lookup fields in an access table.